Today, the Fruitport football team started raising money for new football helmets they say will change the trajectory of the team and protect their players for years to come. 24 Hour News 8 has been following the team during its can drive throughout the community. Here's our story tonight. Ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety cents. Bottles and cans amount to spare change for a football team that could use some. We went one and eight. It sucks, but um, it was an, we started off new. We got a new coach, and uh, things are starting to turn around. So the boys took to the streets to help raise money to fund one major change. Hello. Would you like to donate any pop cans for Fruitport football? We're going to purchase new Vices helmets, the Zero One helmet. Those new helmets are almost $1,000 a piece, but drastically reduce the risk of head injuries like concussions. For the past three years, they've been ranked the number one helmet by the NFL Players Association. They, um, by far, are the safest helmet on the market right now. Um, it is a, quite an investment. And for the first time ever, a high school team in Michigan will wear them. When we first started talking about it, it's one of those things that's a uh, just a crazy goal. It's almost an impossible goal to, to go after, um, but it's something that we believed in. Helmets smashing together. It's a common sound heard here around Fruitport on Friday nights, but with their new Vices helmets that they're raising money to get, should make things a lot quieter. I've never seen this before, and I read all the literature on it, and it, it, these are new, have won the top three safety awards. So I'm like, why not give it to our boys and let them be the first to try these out? The Trojans hope their new helmets translate to more success on the field and off. But that's really a motivation for them to perform on the field, to perform in the classroom, and to be the best that they can be. In Fruitport, Justin Kolar, 24-Hour News 8.